And yes, don't try that at home. And here we have some more of our props and our our big set. Like those windows above, again, are created in the computer. We took them from a picture in Paris and put some clouds going through. What I love the most is interacting with the audience. You never know what to expect. It's different every night. And the weirdest things can happen. Thank you very, very much. You know, something really weird has been happening to me. I keep getting these premonitions. You know when you think of something and then it comes true later on? Well, I've been able to predict graffiti. Yeah. This piece is the graffiti wall, which is really inspired by the idea that you know, to do a mind reading effect without having little billets or, or, or little envelopes or cards or any of those things. We're going to do a mind reading effect that involved everything. It involved uh, uh, a drawing of, from somebody from the audience, names, phone numbers, uh, um, trying to make the best possible mind reading effect we possibly could and using. Um, an unfortunate piece of uh, our society, which is graffiti, but it did allow us uh, to have a very big image that everybody in the audience could see. We had bricks and graffiti and paint, and um, it was a good opportunity for me to have fun with the audience, which I really enjoyed doing. Also, this was different every night. You know, you never knew what the audience would say, what they'd draw. Um, you know, uh, we have the uh, the girl take this little rubber brick and throw it in the audience. Um, uh, certain shows I've had them holding the paint cans, and I tell them to throw the brick, and they've thrown the actual paint cans in the audience. <laughs> Amazing I didn't get sued, but you never know what's going to happen. And she will get to uh, paint uh, a... Um, a picture on the wall, and we've had everybody. We've had people that are Disney artists to fourth grade finger painters. You know, we've had it all. We've had anything could happen in this piece. Sir, what is your favorite color? Yellow. I had um, Hillary Clinton be that girl doing this. She was a pretty good artist. A blue tiger, Tiffany. Above this line, stand up here, stand right up here. Okay, I'll take that. Stand She's right going to step there up and there and uh, make a drawing. Tiger. We've had anatomically correct animals. We've had horses with, well, anatomically correct horses. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, it's a really good opportunity to have um, unusual situations. Oh, your initials. DG. And what is your favorite color? Red. Red DG. Hold on to this, Tiffany. In some uh, some foreign countries, the um, bathing habits of the audience <laughs> haven't been the best, <laughs> and. Uh, uh, it was uh, uh, pretty interesting having to stand there uh, on very hot days with people who, whose hygiene wasn't the, the greatest. Take that brick, throw it behind you as far as you can. Whip it good. The nearest adult guy. This piece was filmed in the Broward County Performing Arts Center in Fort Lauderdale. And um, it's a beautiful theater. We use that a lot um, because it has a lot of depth on the stage and a pretty beautiful audience. Chief Ani, how are you? Richard, the man next to you in the glasses. What is your name? Harvey. Shouldn't it be Harvey? We keep improving this effect. If you see, ever see this in the show, if we ever bring it back, it's totally different. I very carefully kept those names in that order because it would have been a different 
whole different problem if I switch those two names. And who's the lady uh, nearest to you? You have to think on your feet a lot. Judy, five. He's nodding his head yes. I hope you got call waiting. Take these cans of spray paint, put them on that table, and wait for me over there. Tiger Man, where are you? Where's the Tiger Man? There you are. Now, we didn't prearrange this, did we? No, we did not. Tiffany, have we ever met before? No. Uh, DG, where are you? Raise your hand. Dick, Harvey, uh, Judy, I mean, Richard. <laughs> have we met before? In unison! Look up, Unison. <laughs> Come over here. Stand right over here. This envelope's been hanging in full view the entire time. I haven't touched it. If the picture I made before the show matches the picture that we made, that would be a miracle. <laughs> Tiffany, this girl was very great. She was a lot of fun. Great personality. You I'm never know what you're going to get. Does this not impress you? Pretty good. That corner there. Hold it up. Hold it up nice and high. DG 661-9737. You chose the color red. The background was a, um, a takeoff on a Irving Penn uh, photograph. We call it the Irv drop after Irving Penn, whose photographs inspired um, kind of this gray textured drop, which we tied up. John Schaffner and Joe Stewart uh, have art directed um, the TV specials that we've done, most all of them. Great job, you'll see a lot of, there's the singing lesson again. A great automaton. This place is amazing. It's filled with magical history. And we're back into uh, our film set 